Hello, this is Steve Powers. Today I want to show you a quick way to add custom themes to GIMP. I'm using GIMP 2.73 and it only comes with two different uh, themes that you can choose from. Uh, not very different. One has, uh, has uh, smaller fonts than this one. So uh, the first thing you'll need to do is to download some custom themes and then you'll need to install the themes into your GIMP folder. Well, let me show you how to do that. Uh, it's rather easy. First off, go over to GNOME Art. They're at art.gnome.org, and um, I will uh, include this link uh, in the video. Um, I will post it underneath the video, in fact. So um, here we can, uh, at GNOME Art, we can search through the different pages, or we can use a drop-down menu, search by specific name or by uh, popularity. In this case, I know I want Blue Heart. I'm going to download this. It's a very small file, and I'm going to put it into a, uh, a folder I made specifically for this um, tutorial. And here we're going to have to extract this or unzip this uh, twice. Something you have to do with each um, theme that you do. Try out. Now, th this is the root folder, uh, the blue heart. And in there, you're going to find a subfolder, GTK 2.0. Um, some of those subfolders uh, will only have uh, one or two different files, or in this case, a whole lot of them. Uh, what we're looking for is a GTK RC file. We're going to need to copy, of it, copy that into the root folder, and then copy the root folder in its entirety into our GIMP themes folder. In this case, I am on uh, Windows. And I'm going to go into my C drive, Documents and Settings, uh, to uh, whatever username you have GIMP installed under. And then you look for your version in 2.7, um, and right down to your Themes folder. Then just paste it right in. Since I already have it here, I'm just um, overwriting the folder that was uh, already present. Um, but keep in mind, any time that you do add new themes to GIMP, and in this case where I have GIMP open already, I will have to, uh, you, you will have to restart GIMP. In this case, I already had it installed, so GIMP already recognizes a Blue Heart theme. So what we need to do is go back into GIMP, go up to Edit, go up to Preferences, go over to Themes, and now you can see I have Blue Heart theme uh, there. So if I want to preview it, I just um, click it. It takes a, a little bit. And there it is. Now you can also go through um, whatever else uh, you have uh, tried out uh, before you commit to it. Evil Mac. That's a good one. <laughs> I like the name anyways. But Blue Heart is my favorite. It has um, a good general purpose. It's not too dark. It's not too light. So when I since I like that one, I want to keep it. I'm just going to go over the OK and uh, commit it. So next time I run GIMP, this is the thing that will come up with it. Well, hopefully this has helped you, and uh, you can put it to good use. Thank you. See you next time.